Uh, hello, this is Veronica Seban from Business Power Academy. You watch um, the YouTube channel and the power of your mind and inner. And today I have as a guest, um, the <coughs> coach Farouk. Uh, Farouk, could you introduce yourself and tell more about you? Hello, my name is Farouk Kunis. I'm uh, an entrepreneur for more than 20 years right now. I'm the owner of Primo Passo and uh, the online program Digital Life Upgrade. We help overwhelm coaches to adapt their life and grow their businesses in the digital economy fast. Uh, I created a seven part framework so that my customers uh, become role models for their coaching clients, build more confidence and credibility and get more coaching clients online. Mm -hmm. So this is what I'm doing right now. I'm very uh, curious, um, mm -hmm. how do you do that? Uh, I'm very curious about your strategy and approach. Could you tell more about that? Yeah, my program called Digital Life Upgrade. I launched it since uh, last year, 7th of uh, uh, September, 2020. I'm a certified virtual coach as well. A next level coach and the program is made for coaches mm -hmm. for coaches that starting right now or coaches that are for a long time and they, they are finally finally um, want to get more clients through the internet through online mm -hmm. and most coaches as a problem with marketing and sales mm -hmm. And, uh, and I'm doing this program, this digital life upgrade program with my wife together. So we build a complete, something complete new that is not existing in this world. Mm -hmm. And this is international, it's in, everything is English. And uh, what we, the idea is we move your body in this program. So one time a week, we move the members physically so they get more energy and get more productive and reach their goals more faster. I think energy is the most important thing yes. when you want to achieve your goals. Yes. And then once a week, the members goes with me online and I show to them how they can build four information products in one year period. So every 90 days, we build a new digital product, starting with the membership site, an online course, a coaching business, how to set up the tech, the technical part, how to package your information, etc. Mm -hmm. And then, um, and also what we do also do is we protect your emotions, we protect your relationship as well. So we are working on these three levels on your health, on your business and on your relationship as well. So my wife and me, we are six and years married. Mm -hmm and 15 years together and wow. um, and we re we reinvent ourselves oftentimes together we're working together mm -hmm. since more than yeah 15 years right now and um on this journey we 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 discover great tools you know how we become how we can protect our relationship how we become an entity and uh, also tools to resolve conflicts, etc. Mm -hmm. So, and this is also what we are doing. We're going once a month also uh, online and we teach to the members our tools about relationships. So once a week about business, once a week about your health, mm -hmm. we protect your health mm -hmm. and, you know, we generate more energy in your body. So you get more productive and reach your goals faster. And also on the way, become role models. Because I think when you're a coach right now and you're listening right now, I think we need to be role models for our coaching clients. You know, absolutely. Physically, mentally, mentally. and emotionally as yes. well. Yes. And um, that they can believe to us that we get credibility as well. So they believe in to us. Yes. And that's why I'm, I, uh, we come up with this new idea, a new way of mm -hmm. uh, 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 teaching or uh, delivering value to coaches, and especially today. 
because because of the pandemic, because of the coronavirus, always more and more coaches coming up right now and always more people teaching online. And I think uh, this place, this purposeful place that we created right now, Digital Live Upgrade, it's a perfect place to grow your business and become a role model physically, mentally, and emotionally. And... Um, until now, I don't saw any other platform without to break about myself right now. But um, we have a high purpose with this. The high purpose is, you know, to make this world a better place. I think when I can help another coach to get this message, message out there yeah. and grow his business, he can go out and help more people. Yeah. You know, I would like to coach all the world, but I cannot do it by myself. So, of course. When I can help other coaches, a lot of other coaches, uh, we can make this world a better place. So this is the vision that yes. we have. Yes, uh, could you tell uh, us more about your niche? What is your specific niche? My niche is a holistic, we, we take care in a holistic way for coaches. Okay, the coaches are our niches. Mm -hmm. Every coach that wants to build his business, you know, build more confidence and build more credibility and build his business as well, his online marketing business as well. Mm -hmm. So this is my niche. It's kind of a holistic value that we give. But I think everything as a coach, you need to have a lot of puzzle pieces together. Yes, it's like a puzzle. <laughs> it's like a puzzle, you mm -hmm. know. Exactly. And um, that's why I'm, we are really there, really passionate about to help coaches. And I think why we choose coaches are coaches are really motivated to learn. Coaches are really motivated to grow as well. Yeah. And there's a distinction between growth mindset people and fixed mindset people. I don't know. Never heard about Carol Twig, the book. Carol Trek, I can really recommend this book. Yes. She's explaining uh, uh, different types of people. Uh, some people are growth mindset people, some are fixed mindset people. Yep, that and they are goal oriented and they yeah. know exactly what they want and they want to achieve that. Uh, exactly. Uh, fixed mindset people, they are also, they have a limiting belief. They think the world is not changeable, that they are self, not, they are not changeable. They are not They're born like off. this. Yeah, exactly. And um, instead, growth mindset people are people that are believing that they are changeable. We they are, are believing, creators. Exactly. They are believing. Create. Yes. They can change the world. You know, I, those. that's why I'm... And my wife and me, we are the same type of people. We are really growth mindset people. We are, because we reinvent ourselves often. That's why I'm, uh, those kind of people, coaches especially, are our best uh, customers. I have uh, created a strategy uh, which is mm. related to, to your topic. Mm -hmm. In this case, um, there are three uh, levels of thinking on the basis of the three levels of thinking is created the world yes and the classes are are divided like in one two three the low the middle and and the high mm -hmm. and so uh, on basis of the level of thinking um, the people they determine by themselves to which level they belong to the first, to the second, or to the third. So the first one is uh, are the employable people, like they are employee. Uh, the second one is the middle class. So they are in the middle and they are striving um, to work at their personal development and to grow. And the third one, the third level, so are the people who are creators and are, are changing the world. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah, it makes sense. Absolutely. Yeah. Yes. Yes. And I, um, I will talk about uh, my strategy 
uh, during my webinar as well, but I created um, a global live forum mm -hmm. uh, where I'm inviting coaches from all over the world, mm -hmm. uh, entrepreneurs as well, mm -hmm. infopreneurs. I, I uh, name them because mm -hmm. so uh, they are handling with information, yes, and not another uh, fields. And okay, so I would like to introduce myself too. <laughs> yes, <laughs> please. <laughs> yes, <laughs> my name is uh, Veronica Seban. I'm um, the founder and uh, owner of Business Power Academy. I'm an entrepreneur for uh, many years, for more than 14 years. And so I'm the bestseller author of different books as Business Power Academy, Master Your Life, um, and A Beautiful Mind. I'm as well so the author of different uh, business and NLP coaching programs. Uh, as business actions accelerator, design your life story, uh, emotional intelligence, leadership, uh, and many others. Uh, for the people who want to discover all my programs, you call visit my website, uh, www.businesspoweracademy.net. Um, so, and I have uh, changed the strategy this year, it's already 2021. So in 2020, I changed the, the strategy um, and the approach because uh, I would like to collaborate um, with info, infopreneurs from all over the world and to teach, uh, to guide and, and to show them um, that we are creators, we are not followers. And that's very important to master a such mindset. Uh, that, that's the, 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 the basis for every single coach and entrepreneur. So to start with the mindset, because from there, then you can grow up and create everything what is necessary to improve and to change the world. Um, and so I have another question for you. Uh, what uh, has been the biggest failure in your life? Biggest failure? Yes, that's very important. Yeah, absolutely. The biggest failure is your most powerful experience at yes. the end, you know? Yes. Yeah, my biggest failure. So I've been, I used to be a professional dancer for more wow. than 20 years and uh, it was a great time i travel around the world i'm speaking five languages i've been with famous artists like kylie minogue natalie cole like international artists on stage on tv shows etc it was my dream to be a dancer and i accomplished it i achieved it and then i met my wife the last Six years we work together, we travel uh, around the world together, etc. And then we realize that our time is actually ticking. So we yeah. cannot live forever as a dancer. Yeah. So and we needed, we needed also we our wish was to also to have a baby, to have a kid. Yeah. So something we had to change. Something has to be changed. So we needed to pivot our business to something else. And the idea was, this was 2010, and the idea was to open our own coaching agency. Mm -hmm. So we are exciting, you know, you know, this uh, feeling as well, you yes. know, you're exciting, ah, oh, new business, ah, now we come. Especially the enthusiasm. <laughs> exactly, we become a agency owner, etc. Yeah, we give up our dance business, our professional. At once. At once, boom, oh, you know. Yeah. And then all of a sudden, you can really imagine we were always front of 15, 20,000 people performing on stage physically. Yes. yes. And all of a sudden you are in your office front of, uh, front of the blank screen, watching on a blank screen and try to deliver value to entrepreneurs. And, um, and this was a game changer. 
Yeah. You know, and because this was not in my plan to be a businessman or an entrepreneur, mm -hmm. to know about marketing, to know about sales. This was not in my plan. So this situation was really overwhelming for me and really frustrating for me, you know. This was going for two years and I was con I was constantly I was constantly distracted on from my from technology from social mm -hmm. media yeah you know I was watching what other people were doing and comparing my life with them you know you know our money was going down always more down always more less always more less mm -hmm. so I I had really a pressure and um, so this was going so far that one day I was in a car on the road and I get the message from a friend. I watch on my phone and I did a heavy duty car accident. Oh, oh my gosh. Yes. Like I destroyed my car, like my whole body were painting. I broke arms, etc. So, so you lose the orientation. No, I, I was distracted from technology. From, from the, the phone. Exactly. And this is the link now. This is the reason, the purpose, why I come up with digital life upgrade. You know, this mm -hmm. is a part of it to be, to be uh, out of the matrix and have yes. a different view about your life, you know? So, and this, and this was my most frustrating time. So I really risked my life for that. I was for that kind of small uh, uh, really near to death. Yeah, know? yeah, yeah. You touched that. But point. from there, exactly. From there, I really, this was kind of my wake up call. Yeah. From there, I was like, no way. No, I have to bring this agency to a complete different level. I need help. I went out there, search for mentors, search. I read like all tons of different kind of books. All of a sudden, I read every week a new book, new book, new book. Like I was that hungry for information. But I changed our income in mm -hmm. three years to six figure mm -hmm. in really short amount of time. And uh, so it was my most frustrating time, but also most powerful time, you know. The, the most beautiful as well. At the exactly. Same. The most learning process I had over this time. It's exactly. so like a dilemma, you know, so uh, it's uh, very, very extreme. Really extreme. Yes, really very, extreme. very extreme, <laughs> yes. And yeah, that's, because... that, that means dilemma because so you were between, yeah? Uh, it's like you have to, to make a choice or you, yes. you choice for failure or you choice for success. And that's the most beautiful what can be. I know, exactly. And I really believe there are two, two, just two things that change your life. Or something external is happening, what happened to me, the car accident. Mm -hmm. Or something internally is changing something, you know. And this is just these two ways how you can change your life. Or you really say, I really want to change. That you are uh, truly committed. You are committed yes. mentally. Or something is happening mm -hmm. in, in your external world. And it's making like this. You all, of, all of a sudden you wake up and... You have a but different kind of, of acceleration, you know? Yes, but um, a lot depends of your internal world, of your emotions. How do you feel and what do you feel from, from the depth of your inner? What is your deepest desire? And if you have a very deep desire to achieve exactly. that, it will yes. happen. Yes. For, for some people, it takes a short time for some people it takes longer but it at one certain moment it happened it's like it's it's i deeply believe in this thing you know because i have touched it as well like you 
Mm. I have been a dancer for 10 years as well as you. Ah, crazy. <laughs> yes. Wow. Yes. Wow. I did like... it, I did that part time um, uh, in all the Netherlands, Belgium, France as well, in Italy as well. I did it for a short time, but I have a very, very beautiful, amazing career. So uh, um, behind <laughs> the years, uh, but as you, I, I thought, okay, so I cannot do this forever. So I have to, to change my mm. life and to create a, a security, like to, and to make it sure that, that, that I will be happy with my life mm. and then i i at the same time i was doing so the uh, uh, the dancing um and then uh, i was active in the american organization oh, okay yes so i'm someone who who always is going for security <laughs> <laughs> yes yeah. so it's necessary it's... to to having plan a and plan b so just to, yes to, to make it sure that uh, it's yes, not that, easy that you can generate income of course yeah 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 it's not easy it's not easy to make no. the bridge you know from your passion no to, because to i have invested a lot of time and energy money as well and all this experience and knowledge that i acquired during the mm. years it uh, has taken like many years it, that's what i mean it doesn't happen in one day so you have to work very hard for it it yes. it, it it doesn't uh, it comes from nothing it's like because you know <laughs> uh, some people they see you they see your enthusiasm so your energy and they think that it it appears at once no <laughs> <laughs> this is true yes <laughs> only you you know what have you experienced so like you touch the beat with with with, with your finger <laughs> yeah. and with your heart as well so it's exactly but okay so let's go ahead but it's amazing like uh, to um, to share our um, uh, life story our uh, life experience and because of that, so we are today here. Uh, yes. What um, what is your biggest achievement after your failure? After my failure, after your failure, what is your biggest achievement? So my biggest achievement is actually um, so building my agency, growing my agency to six figure business. My biggest achievement is uh, founding my wife, my dream wife. My biggest achievement is but to have a beautiful daughter. Finding <laughs> you, you are, because I'm very surprised. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I'm. Uh, no, uh, I was wishing for a beautiful, like beautiful woman inside and outside. Beautiful, yes. a woman like this, and I achieve it, and I found the right woman. You know, mm. and um, I'm the biggest achievement is also to have a family, to have a beautiful daughter like I have now. Yeah. My biggest achievement, um, I think those things are also part of success in life. Mm -hmm. I Absolutely. don't see success just based on business. You know, mm -hmm. success has to be on different kind of levels. Success is health. It's it's business. It's uh, it's family. You know, family first for me is family always first. Yes, yes. Only and first, uh, first uh, uh, level. Exactly. Another thing was um, was uh, that I finally launched my membership site. So digital life upgrade. It's a membership site. Mm -hmm that I planned out seven years ago, straight after my car accident. Mm -hmm. And I was constantly learning. I was investing so much money for knowledge and taking all kinds of courses and being part of masterminds, etc. cetera. And, and then finally, because of the Corona, because of the pandemic, th thanks to the Corona pandemic, <laughs> 
there it are gave, a lot of benefits. <laughs> it gave me more time. And my wife and me, when in March, all this lockdown happened, we went out there and we coached over 100 people, starting with family, friends. And, you know, we, we use all our knowledge to coach other people. Mm -hmm. And then, uh, then we finally launch our program, Digital Life Upgrade. And this is, I'm really, finally, I'm really aligned with all of the wishes that I had seven years ago, you know, and this, it's a great feeling mm -hmm. to do this. I mean, I'm in a scaling uh, period right now. And, um, but it's such a beautiful feeling. It's such a great community. People. Fulfillment. So it's, it's a personal and professional fulfillment that you are fulfilling it because you, you, you achieved that this. Exactly. Exactly. And this is, this makes me really, really happy. Although, I mean, I know it needs a bit of time and to grow everything, but yeah. uh, we are on the right track and we are really in the phase of scaling this membership site yeah. right now. Yeah. That's you very know, important. Yeah, those I think are my most uh, biggest achievement. And also another thing, when I go back more and more in my life, with three years, my father left me, left wow. us, you know. So my uh, I left, I lived just with my mom together. Mm -hmm. So my future could look different right now. Yeah. But uh, I was searching for luck mm -hmm. you know i was working for it to yes. be lucky yes you have to and work i think hard exactly and uh, i think i searched it and i found it i accomplished my dream job to be a dancer to be on stage with famous artists and uh, now i have more more dreams i think dreaming a lot of people don't dream today because with all of this craziness what's going on right now but i really believe all of us should have a, have a dream at least you know yes. everybody should dream yes. dreaming is something nice when you don't know on which island you want to arrive you will swim around in the ocean without to know where to go where, where to, to swim go, yeah. and you will lose so much energy on the way and time time as well exactly I think it's really important to understand where you want to go, which direction you want to go. Yes, it you depends know, on your, your purpose? purpose and mission yeah. at the same time. So exactly. uh, it's very important to having uh, clarity in what you want to do and how and why. So you, yes. have, you need a very big why. Why do you want to do that? Yes. And, you know, I have created... Um, uh, wishes mind map, which is related to this topic. I have shared uh, these uh, wishes mind map so uh, into my community, business actions accelerator. So mm. I will, will tell a little bit about the strategy behind is uh, business actions accelerator. So it means that you are the accelerator of your actions. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so Great, sounds interesting. Yeah. I I built something similar. Um, it's it's kind of a system, a framework, how you can get more mental freedom mm -hmm. and control. You know, you talk about the why, but another thing that I really discovered is your identity. It's the most important thing. Mm -hmm. You know, how do you present yourself? Exactly. No, how you see yourself, which kind of self-image you have, you have mm -hmm. about yourself. Mm -hmm. Since that I discovered this, everything is just flawless. Everything, everything what I do, my routines in the morning, when I do sport, I'm not thinking twice because I, I say to myself, this is me. I don't push myself in the morning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I say, this is myself. You know, there are two different kind of motivation. Tony Robbins is talk about this push motivation and pull motivation, you know? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And pull motivation is stronger. Push, when you always push yourself, push yourself, and all of a sudden you're like, ah, I'm dead, you know? When you are exhausted. <laughs> exactly, of... you're exhausted. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And um, I think uh, when you understand which kind of identity you have, 
it's much more powerful. Yes, Your you are enjoying. Your wine is coming second, you know, and then as a third, it's coming your uh, your direction, what you want. Yes. What you want from life, for your relationship, for your business, for your health. I think it's really important to understand that you know yes, it concerns the goal settings and to to know how to set the goals and how to achieve them exactly i have exactly. a video on my youtube channel about this and about the edmt as well because uh, identity level is the first level of the nlp uh, coaching yeah great. great so it belongs to the personal development you cannot uh, moving forward without your identity, without knowing who you are. Really great. Yes. yes. So it's it's very important to to know yourself. Really great. Sounds but great. I awesome. discovered that a lot of people they don't know who they are, and I think that this is a big aha moment for many of them who wants to to work at their personal uh, development and go out. But it's very interesting that you found it out it by yourself. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's I very mean, powerful. I'm, I think um, I, I read a lot of books, you know, yes. and yes. like uh, Jim Rohn is talking about, readers are leaders. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Readers are leaders. So uh, I think feeding we your are mind... are leading with... the world. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Feeding your mind with the right information is today really important. Really, really important. Yeah. Personal growth is today. That's why I, I honor you mm -hmm. to get, uh, you know, all these people together and interview them. And uh, you're doing a great job. Yes, because uh, at the same time, I learn a lot from, from the people through the questions. And, and you inspire other people, you know, yeah. and this is great. Yes. Yeah, yeah, it's it's impactful. That's that's why we we are coaches. And one uh, more question is the last question about your background because so you have uh, been living in Italy now in Germany. You speak Italian, you speak <laughs> Germany, but your name is Faru. Where are you yes, from? Yes, <laughs> exactly. I'm so I'm born. <laughs> I'm born in Germany. Yeah, but my wife is Italian. Oh. I'm Turkish. I'm Turkish. My roots are from Turkey. Oh. In 1950, my grandfather came here to work. Hoşgeldin. Hoşgeldin. Evet. You can also speak Turkish. Great. Evet. <laughs> wow. So and then, um, so I'm. My roots are Turkish. I born in Germany, and my wife is Italian. And my kid is half Italian, half Turkish. So. <laughs> a very interesting combination. <laughs> <laughs> yes. It's full of richness. <laughs> well, yeah. I hope. I hope. <laughs> yes, I think so. <laughs> yeah. 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 But it's very nice. So to, to see uh, a such uh, um, rich background, because you know when there are two cultures together. So it it, uh, it if we can measure that richness, it's uh, it's truly uh, richness because so two cultures together, two languages. I mean, for the people who can realize that. Yeah. And I'm very curious. Um, how many language uh, does speak your do daughter? She's speaking two and a half languages. So I said two and a half because German she speaks, Italian she speaks perfect. And now English half, and oh. now she's getting also Turkish from my mom, and uh, yeah, nice. We, yeah, we don't. I think kids can learn faster. They don't yeah. think so much like we adults, you know. And I'm really actually really happy that she gets so much languages right now. And uh, yes, it's very important. I have two a daughter of twenty, and and she speaks um, five languages. Mm -hmm. like me mm -hmm. uh, so I'm very very happy that I, I uh, could contribute to her uh, personal growth so I'm very proud of her um, she's studying uh, media management at university mm -hmm. in Netherlands mm -hmm. and all the design that you 
see on my website is designed by my daughter. Oh, really great. Yes, she's a professional in, in her field. Uh, so they are studying how to make um, programs for the television as well. Oh, wow. Yes. Oh, interesting. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's great. a very, very clever, uh, <laughs> clever girl. girl. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Really I great. want to thank you for your time and so for this beautiful and, and interesting interview. So I discovered a lot of things. <laughs> 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 thank you for these great questions and thank you for having me as well. Yes. yes. And uh, it I was like what a you're doing. Yes. So and we stay in touch. Yes, of course, because I have organized a webinar for mm -hmm. 30 January and I would like to invite coaches as guests. So if mm -hmm. you like it and if you are available, of course, then I would like to invite you. Yes. And uh, then outside that, I'm going to organize a global live forum meeting with many coaches from all over the world really great sounds great yes sounds if uh, if it uh, makes sense for you of course you are welcome I, i'm really open absolutely yes i will let you know more about that yes. and so by now uh, i wish you a beautiful and productive day to you and to your whole family Thank i you. want to invite our guests to like and to subscribe to my channel and if you have a link of your website uh, yes. i would like to share the link of your website on my yes. channel if you yes. have a ebook as well so you can yeah. share your ebook with us mm -hmm. And then the people can book you and can visit your website. Okay, Thank great. you again. Take care. And I see you soon. Bye-bye. See you soon. Bye-bye. Thank you.